I'm in year seven at White Lodge. I'm in year eight. We're in the graduate year now. I'm James Hay. I'm a first soloist with the Royal Valley. We all went to the Newcastle J's. I went to Totnes Associate Centre. I was a J at Barons Court, so the old residence. We met at East J's yeah. and we started in year four. year four. So we've known each other for seven, nearly eight years now. Yeah. Our mums became really good friends. <laughs> so, so we became really yeah. good friends. <laughs> it was very, very different from, from dancing back home in the local school. A much more concentrated training regime. It was a bit scary at first. Going to a ballet class that wasn't at my dance school and seeing all these other, other people that were all so amazing. We had a lot more masculine things to do than my normal class. And to be surrounded by other boys that also wanted to do the same thing and were interested in similar things to you. Like it was a good kind of um, social experience as well. Definitely yeah. made me more behaved. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> First time I ever danced with the Royal Ballet on stage was um, in their production of Ondine and they had JAs performing in that. So it gave you so many opportunities to perform with world-class companies. You don't really get that from any other institution almost. I didn't know anything about White Lodge until J.A.'s. I didn't really know when I could come here or how I could audition. When we joined White Lodge there was one other boy yeah. from our J.A. centre and it does help at the beginning of the school. It was uh, nice to like yeah, know someone. Definitely. So one person the year above and, and below. The and year a below. few from the year below yeah. that we knew. I think that was quite nice for them coming to the school the year after us because we could talk to them about what it was like. It's kind of good because we can help each other with like train journeys and car journeys. Yeah. I think I'd probably be at my old dance school just doing festivals and competitions. I'd still be doing like half an hour a week of ballet <laughs> instead of two hours every day and more than that. <laughs> if I hadn't applied for J's, I'd I don't think my, I'd have been so lucky to have gone so far in this school, definitely. I, I know exactly what I'd be doing. I'd be doing something to do with aeroplanes. I, I'm absolutely aeroplane crazy still to this day. But the experience, um, I think, really spurred me on to really believe that this is what I wanted to do with my, my life.